Hey guys, so welcome to the second video on my channel. I promise I won't say which number of video it is every time I introduce it, but thanks for watching. Um, so I figured right now I'd do my Birch Box review. Whew. Um, so I just subscribed to Birch Box and Ipsy. Um, so this is actually the first box I've gotten. I haven't gotten my Ipsy bag yet. It's supposed to come mid-May, so hopefully that'll happen. But yeah, I'm really excited. Um, you know, I've, I've been watching videos of reviews or unboxing of Birchbox and Ipsy for a while, so I know that Birchbox is kind of falling behind a little bit. Some people would disagree. Totally depends on, like, what you do on their quiz of, like, what you want in your box and all that. Um, but, yeah, so I figured I'd give it a try, and I'm excited to keep getting these because, let's face it, this is 10 bucks a month for products that I would go out and spend like $50 for probably because I would have no idea if they're good or not and then I'd go like try them who knows so I'm excited I see this is a win-win situation either way I'm getting the amount of products that I'm paying for um, and it's like free stuff it's Christmas every twice a month so twice a month meaning Birchbox and Ipsy it's only once a month per subscription so yeah so this is what it looks like inside. I don't know if you can see that. Cool. Um, and the theme this month, because it's, well, this one was April. I know it's like May 2nd right now while I'm filming. I don't know when this will go up, but, um, but so they did Rainy Days is their theme for April. So it says, hands up if you secretly love a gloomy forecast. Eh, not really, but, um, April showers may bring May flowers, but they're also a blissful excuse to stay tucked inside doing all those things that fall by the wayside when it's glorious out. This month, we're embracing that rainy day mentality. Why not shut the blinds and curl up with a good book or spend a luxurious afternoon playing with beauty samples? I would gladly spend every afternoon playing with beauty samples. Um, in addition to a crop of new and exciting products, you'll find some bright ideas for how to spend the next rainy day, and there are many more waiting for you at birchbox.com slash rainy days. Turns out a little precip er, precipitation isn't so bad after all. Rain or shine, birch box. So that's cool. Um, it's kind of a cute card, too. They've got cookie baking stuff in the corner. Um, cool. So, yeah. Um, I'll start with... Ooh, cracked my back there. That was fun. Um, the Kind Snacks. It's my lifestyle extra. Um, the Kind Snacks Healthy Grains Bar Maple Pumpkin Seeds with Sea Salt Flavor. Um, a 15 count of these is 11.88, so let's do some quick math. This is less than a dollar. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so I actually, <laughs> when I got my birch box, I was running a class. Um, I'm, a, I'm about to finish my senior year of college, Ooh. Um, and I'm going to grad school. So when I was running a class, I was like, I will need this. Finals are coming up, so I already ate it. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is what it was. Um, and I'm not a big fan of pumpkin seeds. I'm not... I don't really like them. Um, so it, I was like, uh, okay. Um, but it was sustenance for a long class, so I appreciated any food I could get. Um, but it was actually really good. I really enjoyed it. Um, this one is gluten free, um, and it's all natural, no GMO. And it's got five super grains oats, millet, quinoa, amaranth, I've never heard of that one, and buckwheat. So that's cool. Um, and it was honestly really good. I enjoyed it. Um, I've heard a lot of good things about Kind, and I know they send stuff from this company a lot in Birchbox. So that was good. I liked that. Cool. Next was... Um, oh, this is kind of part of the... I, it's not a number product. This isn't one of my five things. Um, but this is the 52 Bright Ideas for a Rainy Day, and I got tip number 33. my tip. No, oh, there's two things. Well, this is kind of more just an ad for Birchbox, um, but it says, rain or shine, get shopping. When you rack up 500 Birchbox points within a calendar year, you'll earn a spot in the Birchbox Aces. Oh, okay. So it's like a VIP program. So that's information about that. Um, so tip number 33 says, dust off your board game collection. We're big Scrabble fans. Um, if you're hanging solo, there's always solitaire. Sure, cool. There's also tips on the back that say tip number three, hit the snooze button and go back to bed. Okay, I have class, so I can't really do that. Um, tip nine, think cozy chic. Pull out your oldest, most worn in sweatshirt. I'm a fan. Tip number 21, write a just because note to a friend or relative you haven't spoken to in a while. That's a nice one. 
that's a cool one. I like that. Um, because I'm definitely one of those people that I fall out of touch with people simply because I don't take the time. Not that I don't like them anymore, it's just I do a lot of things, so good tip. Cool. So next is the Harvey Prince Yogini. Yogini? Yogini? I don't know. Um, it's a stress-dissolving scent that mixes light, crisp notes of grapefruit with star, star jasmine. Um, the full size of this is $55. Um, and this sample is, how much are you, you know, doesn't say how many ounces this one is, I don't think, but, does it? No, it doesn't. Um, but it does, it smells pretty good. Oh, face that the wrong way. So it, it does smell really good. I mean, like, they describe it as being a fragrance that, like, calms you and, like, soothes you. And while I will agree that there's, like, a lot of, like, scents in there that are kind of soothing, the overall, it's like kind of musky, which makes me feel like awake, slash, I don't know. It makes me think of like Abercrombie. Not like the scent, but the underlying scent. Next is the Color Club Gala's Gems Collection, and this is in Heirloom Pearls. Um, there's a set of four for $13, so this is worth a little bit under $3, or over, sorry, a little over $3, $3.30. And it's just basically a nice, really pearly color. I don't know. I mean, it's not white, so that's nice because I will not wear white nails. But it is a nice pearly color. It's a little too light for me because I'm a ghost. I look a little pinky something in this lighting because um, this is just temporary lighting while I'm still unpacking everything. Um, oh, yeah, I moved. I don't know if I said that. Um, but, yeah. Um, so I don't know if I would do this. But it is a really nice one. I'll try it. I'll probably use it for, like, an accent of some kind. Um, but yeah, so not a lose there, not a lose, just me. Um, and my last two, oh, no, last three, um, let's see, I'll do this one, okay, so, um, this is the number four high performance hair care clarifying shampoo, the full size of this is $32, and this is one fluid ounce, um, so I'd assume the full size is probably 12 ounces or so, so that's pretty good, that's a decent size. Um, and that's maybe four, three or four uses out of that. I have, even though I have fine hair, I do have like long hair, so I do use a lot of shampoo. Um, vitamin rich botanicals gently purify hair while restoring lost moisture, moisture and shine. Cool. Oh, and they added, okay, so I didn't notice this was a separate thing. Um, so then they added in a bonus, which is the reconstructing mask for your sleekest strands yet. The full size of this is $58. Whew. Okay, cool. 58 bucks for a hair mask. Um, and this is a quarter of an ounce. I really like this description. It's kind of a little much, but I enjoy it. Um, Lumiere de River, whatever it's called. I'm not going to pronounce things correctly. If I can't pronounce it, I'm going to make fun of myself while I pronounce it. So whatever it is. Lumiere something is the result of a clear winter sunrise where I stood watching with downy feathers floating from the loose curls on my hair. I don't know about that sentence. That's a weird one. Our wispy troop was wendi wending its way home? Did they mean winding? Wending its way home in a particularly poetic state of dishevelment, ending a night that would be remembered quite beautifully. Um, this brand combines nature's finest ingredients, cutting-edge technology, and the innovation to not only present a high-performance hair care collection, but to actively improve the state of our planet. Cool. So does this mean it's like, I don't think this is organic. This has a lot of stuff in it. I don't know. But, um, cool. Excited to try it. I use coconut oil in my hair, like, I'm like, I'll do a, like, mask, essentially, of coconut oil for one or two times a week, so I don't know how much I'd use this, but I'll definitely try it. Exciting. Cool. And then the last thing, the last thing is the Sumitas pronunciation, I don't know, um, color contrast eyeliner in, oh god, this is like testing all my pronunciation skills. Jamun, Jamun, J-A-M-U-N is how it's spelled. And this is deep purple color. The full size of this is $11. I'm willing to bet this is probably like a half size sample. So that's not bad. It's five and a half bucks. Um, 
So it says this soft wax pencil delivers rich, long-lasting color that won't irritate eyes. So that's nice. And it is a really nice purpley color. You can see that. Nice lines, Kim. I did a good job. Those are some straight lines. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to use this because I have brownish, hazelish eyes and purple is a good color for me. So um, I'm going to go Birchbox, guessing. So that's it for my Birchbox video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I have just signed up for Birchbox and Ipsy. They're both $10 subscriptions. You get um, a box or a bag for Ipsy um, once a month and it comes with anywhere from four to six samples. Um, yeah, so once I start getting Ipsy's after this first month, because it, it'll come at a different time than this one, um, I will start doing these together because they come around the same time. So yeah, if you enjoyed this video, please like or comment or subscribe. I would love subscriptions. Um, and if you have any suggestions of videos I should do, if there's any tags or any specific things, um, please feel free to comment below and suggest them. I will take any suggestions I get. Um, yeah, so, alright, thanks guys.